good morning everybody it is sunday morning february 10th i'm just doing my daily check-in um today's not a great day um woke up very lethargic um severe muscle pain and weakness uh definitely some shortness of breath we have a flight of stairs and every time i have to go up the stairs um i'm having a little difficulty getting wind um, nauseous. I was able to get breakfast in, but I just don't feel that great. Um, to look at myself in the mirror is not pretty. I've got dark circles under my eyes and some swelling under my eyes. Um, I just look kind of sick. My skin just looks, I look kind of gray. So, um, we were in an RV all day yesterday, so it's not like I, you know, blew it out yesterday and overdid it by any means. Um, I even slept a little bit in the RV, and even all last week while I was at Mayo, I mean, I did a couple of workouts, but even struggled with those and couldn't recover after, so I didn't do much of that. Um, walked the dog, of course, every day and did what I could, but just not feeling good. So just briefly kind of want to... Um, explain what breast implant illness has taken away from me as far as um, my quality of life. Um, I'm a uh, personal trainer slash health coach by trade. I um, have had to lessen my workload, decrease my hours, cut some of my classes, uh, turn away new clients, uh, lessen the um, sessions for the clients I currently have because I just don't have the energy. Um, my own exercise, being able to keep my own fitness, I've not been able to do that um, because of energy, because of pain. Um, my, bus, my body won't maintain muscle mass. So my physique has uh, somewhat declined. Um, Hobby-wise, um, used to love to ride my horse. I haven't been able to ride for a really long time. First, because of pain, and uh, and then it got to the point where my anxiety levels, my central nervous system being so overstimulated that um, when I would get on my horse, I was so wound up that he could feel it, and then he would get more wound up, and it wasn't fair to him. So I had to, thank God, I found a couple of wonderful women that are leasing him so that he's at least getting ridden and loved on and um, I had to love him enough to let him go, right? So that was really hard and still continues to be hard. Um, I can't do all the activities I'd like to do. I mean, I'm usually very active by nature and I like to go, go, go. And there are days where I can, don't get me wrong. But there's a lot more days like today um, and they're kind of happening more frequently. I used to have like um, a couple of bad days a week and now I have a reverse where I'll have a couple of good days in a week and the rest I'm just really struggling. So, uh, you know, I know that I'm going to be getting them out soon and I am very hopeful that that's going to change the game for me from a lot of the stories I read from these women, but that's where I'm at today. Just kind of not a great day. Don't feel good. Don't look good. And uh, I'm just going to rest as much as I can today. Try and start my work week again tomorrow and see how that plays out. And super looking forward to um, meeting with a couple of surgeons next week to hopefully find someone that fits what I'm looking for and can um, get me on the road to recovery. That's it. Hope you guys have a happy Sunday. God bless.